Hello guys, hope you are well. Today I'm going to show you one of my deep learning based project and that I developed few days ago. So I would like to show that uh, how it actually looks. So it's basically a project uh, uh, for detecting beard guy and non beard guy. So this is the actual code for this. And if I run it, uh, it's loading that model. So it's taking some time in order to load that model so uh, i trained that model with lots of images and then i made the model and now using that uh, you can see the models uh, i have built that model resnet i use resnet uh, 50 models and and then loading that model so first what we can so in order to uh, show how it works uh, first we need to load some images so basically and uh, this is the image so uh, you can see this this boy you can say <clears throat> he, he, he has clean shape he doesn't have beard so if I just predict that so you can see a uh, non beard guy so this this boy doesn't have any beard so in the model actually predict that thing uh, then take that image and predict that you can see this is beard guy and the equation is around uh, the equation you know, of the <clears throat> probability is 99.99% and take this image and uh, this is also a non beard guy and this model can actually predict multiple um, persons at the same time as well so uh, in this case if you take this image so you can see this is a non beard guy and this is a beard guy because basically it's the same image of the two guy so you can see this is non beard guy and this is beard guy and, and if we take some other images like this one then predict that okay non beard guy and the, the, this is beard guy and now this one and then predict it so it's a non beard guy you can see it from here as well and this one so beard guy both are beard guys and uh, here this is a beard guy and the uh, uh, probability is around 85.56% uh, this is this is a beard guy and this is non beard guy so by this way this uh, uh, software can actually detect any kind of beard and non beard guy easily and uh, for this I actually use a lot of images okay so you can see these are the images that has been used for the training things and for the okay, again so you can see there are lots of beard guy in these images so i just use this data set to uh, basically i made this data set i download lots of images from google and some other sources the, these are stock images or uh, google images actually so i use is use it as a data set and for the non beard guy i use some male and female uh, because uh, this uh, image they don't have beard so i can use them as well because we don't actually need some negative images and the people with faces who, who doesn't have any kind of beard so i use and because i need some images i need a lot of images so i download these images from google and some other free stock uh, images uh, collections so and then i train that model and the model is around so the model is around 200 uh, 270 megabytes and i have trained it for around uh, more than 10 hours i guess so it's so you can see it's really working and it can actually predicting the non beard and beard guy easily so that's the project and it is working very fine so hope you like it and this kind of project might be might be helpful in detecting some beard guy and non-beard guy in any kind of society we can actually develop any kind of uh, humans by, like this way by developing some sort of softwares so hope you like it and please pray for me thank you